Hey what's up YouTubers, Mr. Double back with another video and today I'm going to show you how to make a cinematic in Kerbal Space program or a machinima in Kerbal Space program, you know, whatever you want to call it. Uh, so how about we get started, you are going to need one mod and that is Kerbcam, that's included in the description below, it's super simple to install, no big deal, you could, re you could read the readme, but how about we get started right now. Uh, so just go to start game normal. One thing before we begin is you might want to increase the resolution of your footage and also maybe install a texture pack. Uh, because you know to make a cinematic you got to make it look really nice and I love and I love squad But you know it's not the best looking game in the world So I want you to scenario right now because it's a lot easier to make this so I'll we'll go to continue Alrighty Jebediah is in orbit around Kerbin nice easy orbit 150 meters 150,000 meters and there is our ship our capsule whatever you want to call it and here is Jebediah Alrighty then, let's say we want to make a nice uh, circle cam movement like this, okay? So what you're going to need to do for this is press F8 once curve cam is installed. So press F8 right now, and this menu should come up, curve cam zero, curve cam 0 0.12. Uh, it's really easy to use, how about you just click the camera controls, and what this does is basically it's the camera controls. It moves the camera around like this, back and forth, uh, it, can, it can look down at this with an angle like so. It can zoom out, it can zoom in. So to begin our first scene, we're gonna have to go to New Simple Path. Click that, and now we have a camera. This is gonna be the first frame it's gonna go to. So how about we do a little nice uh, angle right now to make it go down. Alrighty then. Now let's click New Key to start it off. Okay, click New Key, and there you go, it makes a keyframe. Now we want to move to the right a little bit, so let's go to the right with this motion right here. It was right, and now we want to look at him. We have, we want to look at Jebediah also, so we're gonna you know change the angle a little bit to the left like so. And there you go. Let's make a new keyframe. Let's go a little bit more and make a new keyframe. Uh, there you go. Now go a little bit more. A new a new little angle I guess I don't know what to call it let's move a little bit more it's okay you can adjust this in between if something's not wrong the program will smooth it out uh, there you go a little bit more this way new keyframe there you go and there you go let's now zoom in on his face you know just for like that added effect uh, just look up a little bit and start zooming in that's a really bad angle, but I think you guys get the point. A new key for the last frame. And now if we press play, if we click the play button, it will start playing our cinematic. So how about we click that right now? As you can see, once you press F2, everything will go away, and you can record your nice uh, cinematic shot. It's slowly moving them. If you want this to go faster, have less keyframes. Uh, there you go. As you can see, that was a little jolt right there. We'll fix that later. Well, you can fix you can fix that, but I'm not going to fix it because sick of time. And there you go. We zoom in in this weird angle to his left side. Well, to his right side, I'm, I'm guessing. Okay, now let's press F2 again to bring the screen back up. And you know, it's pretty. That's pretty much all I have for you. It's really simple to do, and you can't really do this when you're using the arrow keys because it just looks bad. If you want to cancel the path that you just made, just press X. Like for example, it's really hard to do this shot with the normal cam like so it's really it's too fast it doesn't you know look good uh, the program smooths out the camera movement so everything's really nice and smooth and you know what yeah and you could always change the relative to so what you start off looking at so let's go to relative to uh, curb EVA or curb one active vessels right now I'm just doing active vessel because that's the one that I'm looking at and there you go we've drifted where is our capsule it's X out of this you know what? I lost. I'm lost in space. God dang it. Oh well. Oh there it is. So that's pretty much all for this tutorial. It's really simple but I think you guys can make some really cool stuff with this and that's all. Yeah, thank you for watching and goodbye.